uh, riders just preparing themselves for their second semi-final. Beauty off the inside in red. Jack Holder out of gate number two in blue. Leon Madsen, gate number three in white. And Max Rick off the outside in yellow. I tell you what, this is so difficult to call. You just don't know quite which way it's going to go. Can we have one Danish rider in the final tonight? We've just seen two riders slip out with Mickelson and Hansen just missing out in the first semi. And taking his time with just a few seconds left there. Here we go then, semi final number two. Green light is on, takes her up. Away we go. Jack Holder's made a terrific start. Oh, Bewley out of shape there. That could cost him dearly. Does he recover? No, he doesn't. He's been swamped down the back straight. Leon Madsen coming through in the second place with Frick on the outside. That does Leon Madsen a real favour now. Bewley back into third place. But Jack Holder, who has enjoyed a terrific night of speedway, looks good out in front. Leon Madsen, what a move it was out of gate number three down the back straight. Looking solid in second place. Yeah, looking solid. Scared everybody entering turn three with a front wheel in the air, a bit like Mickelson. But he's hanging on to it at the moment. I'll tell you what, Dan Bewley hasn't given up, but with the rain coming down, it's too slippery as you go across the slick stuff into the dirt. It's hard to make up ground. And uh, Leon Madsen, I think, just riding calmly around the inside, doing all of the right things. But Jack Holder chose gate two made the great start riding superbly tonight holder out in front he's going to go through to another final he's been rock solid finished second in cardiff and he's there again in boy and so is leon madsen home crowd are chuffed to bits with that they've got a representative in the last race of the night but for jack holder what a moment that is and as he returns to injury he makes two consecutive finals and he's looked set to charge into the top three tonight Got to believe he's going to be in third place as he leaves Roins this evening. Leon Madsen looking very accomplished indeed. So Holder and Leon Madsen in the final. Dan Bewley and Max Frick missing out there in the semi-finals. Disappointment for Bewley. Um, uh, initially looking good there. It was tight in the first corner, but um, just got himself in no man's land coming out of gate two, which you can do here. Max Frick, his night is ended, but uh, did remarkably well to make the semi-finals on seven points picks up a handy points tally but uh, we'll see the semi-final once again here holder terrific out of the start yeah jack holder there right across dan beauty dan has to shut the throttle off two wheels into the corner loses all of his speed leon madsen there i think max frick thought he was going to be able to get into the corner but uh, when you uh, look over your left shoulder and you see leon madsen entering the corner with the front wheel in the air i think Max actually taking evasive action there, just moving wide. And there was Dan Bewley up the inside of him. But uh, got to say, Jack Holder looks superb tonight. We know he enjoys this track. Had a superb Speedway of Nations last year. And he really is turning on the style tonight. He is indeed. And he's looking really good indeed. Could he win his first Grand Prix of his career? Robert Lambert searching for his one as well. Could be quite a tussle between those two. Both of them riding extremely well this evening.